hi guys how are you doing i hope you're good welcome back to another tutorial and in today's video i'll be showing you how i make these locks step by step from the beginning to end if it's your first time you're watching my video thank you so much you're welcome my name is glory mtui kindly subscribe and leave your comments below also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find this video is useful in this video I used expression and I used two different color I used 30 color and I also used color 1 color 30 I cut into two equal parts and then I stretch my hair and this is how I stretch and then I brush my hair well from down to avoid losing too much hair this is the section I'll be using not so big and not so small and i also use a straw but see you have to make sure your straw is a little hard not too soft so i put my section over here and then i bend a little this straw and i use bobby pin to secure on top then i hold the hair back together and i start rolling when i wrap it so I make sure I roll it well and then I wrap on this straw till the hair finish and then then I bend the straw again to secure this hair and then I take another bobby pin and I secure and this is how the hair looks like after I finish I also use color one just to spice up a little bit my locks so this color one I cut into three equal parts and then I stretch it as well then I brush it This is also amount I'll be using to make curly in this hair. So I repeat exactly the same thing as I did in 30 color. And then I hold them together and I roll and wrap on this straw till I make sure the hair finish. And end of this hair, I also take a bobby pin and I secure the hair well in this straw then I trim off all the excess hair just to make sure the curly will be clean when I want to take off then I bend the straw and I add bobby pin and this is how the hair looks like this is one pack of color 30 in black color I only use half package I add a little leave-in conditioner you can add any leave-in conditioner then I add hot water then I leave my braiding hair in hot water for one minute then I take them off and I put somewhere to wet them become completely dry I use this yarn to attach on the wall and I attach two pieces as you see here the hair is completely dry and I trim off and just a little to make it easy to remove from the straw and then I cut end a little to make it easy to separate this hair. So this is how the hair looks like guys. So I arrange it over here. 
and then I take black color and I remove from the straw then I separate them as well because I'm going to put a very small amount of this black hair after I separate I also cut into two then I go ahead and start separate them how I make my loop I make sure I twist on top just to make sure the loop is well then I take a very small section and I secure this loop to make sure this loop will not close I secure two time each one then I started with black color then I wrap till I finish this section of black hair here I'm wrapping very loose if you ever do locks you know how loose I'm wrapping not tight at all just very loose so after black color finish I make sure I separate brown color so that I can get good locks and then I start wrapping as well in this tutorial I make three different length so the first one I'm going to make seven inches when I continue wrapping, I make sure I also check the size of the locks because I want my locks to be with the same size. If it's seven, I want these 10 pieces to be equal. So here after I finish wrap this section, I find that the black color is too long. I trim this black color and then I check the length and I find I'm near to seven inches so I add a little amount of hair and I continue wrapping after I make seven inches the remaining hair I separate them into small section and then I wrap them going back and I wrap the hair till the hair finish then I put the locks on my palm and I roll it and guys this is how seven inches looks like you can see the loop is there bigger enough this is how the locks looks like this is seven inches so I make ten pieces of seven inches and this is how it looks like Same. 
So total I have 40 pieces of braiding hair and I use one and half braiding hair. So here I'm going to show you how you can put them in wire and you can put also in plastic bag ready for sale or you can keep for your own uses. And you can see how the locks looks like guys they looks beautiful <laughs> I hope you enjoy guys watching this video and you get something new if yes kindly subscribe like this video comment and share with other ladies you wish they can see this video I will see you soon on my next video bye bye